I'm very excited to talk to you about the brand new Adobe Illustrator CS6. This is actually a historic release for us here at Adobe. It's Illustrator's 25th anniversary. But I think it's a very important release for designers as well. To begin with, for CS6, Illustrator delivers the Mercury performance system. This not only means working with efficiency and stability, but it also means being able to create, save, and open large and complex files. For this release, the engineering team put a great deal of effort on entirely rebuilding Illustrator from the ground up. For example, Illustrator CS6 now delivers native 64-bit support. In the new interface, you can now rename layers directly in the Layers panel, without having to open an intermediate dialog box. And there are over 30 enhancements to the user interface, and that means you can complete your day-to-day -day tasks more efficiently. But we've also included some powerful new creative options for you. With Illustrator CS6, you can now create repeating seamless vector patterns very easily. As you create your pattern, you have access to all the drawing and transformation tools, and you can select from a whole bunch of different tiling types and offset options. Also, Image Trace is a completely new vector tracing engine that not only gives you better results than the older Live Trace feature, but it's also far easier to use. Starting with a raster image, such as a photograph or a scan, you can quickly generate clean, editable vector paths that have fewer points, better color recognition, and much better shapes. Illustrator CS6 also offers you gradients on strokes. And this is another one of those features you have been wanting for quite some time. Gradients can now be applied along the length, across the width, and within a stroke itself. And these are only a few of the new features in Illustrator CS6. I hope you give it a try and experience it for yourself.